DJ had mentioned he was using that curveball a little bit more than he has perhaps in the past. Why do you think he leaned on that pitch more, and why do you think it was successful for him? Um, well, it's it's part of his arsenal and an important part of his arsenal. So, um, you know, you know, even when you're or as when you're really good, uh, you, you've you know you got to make subtle adjustments all the time, and especially against teams that are familiar with you. And um, thought he did a good job of that tonight. Speaking of DJ, first multi home run game since May of 2021. Just what's what it was different about him at the plate tonight? I know he's been swinging the bat better overall in the second half. Yeah, it was so good to see. Um, again, I think just a little more life within his, you know, load, getting on his backside a little bit. That's getting him a little, building a little speed in his swing. Um, so I just think he's a little faster. You know, uh, you know, rifles the ball up the middle off of Eflin and gets a hanger and hits it out. And then, you know, off off the uh, uh, side armor to, to be able to uh, ride one out of there as well. It was... Uh, it was really good to see him have that level of it. Playing against the arrival like the Rays in an environment like this, does that help your team? Oh, I don't know. I mean, it's a tough place to play. So, uh, you know, we, we're taking day by day, you know, trying to put our best foot forward and taking a lot of pride in what we do. And, um, you know, we want to go out there and win ball games. And uh, I thought, you know, it was a complete game tonight. I thought Eflin was really good. But I thought, I thought our at bats against him were good. You know, he punched us out a handful, uh, quite a bit. Um, but I think that's a credit to how well he was pitching. But we were able to square a lot of balls up against him. You know, even before we kind of broke it open. Um, you know, I thought I thought really good at bats ahead of the uh, Pereira single the other way that, you know, put us up two nothing. But Izzy smoked a ball, um, Volpe smoked a ball. You know, so I just thought you know, some really good at-bats off a guy in the middle of a good year that I thought threw the ball well for them. What did you see from Stanton tonight? Had those hits last night and then again tonight? Yeah, uh, good to see, you know. Uh, I thought a really good walk in there. And then obviously, you know, that the hit that kind of, you know, in a lot of ways put it away a little bit. So um, just a little more athletic up there, um, getting on time a little bit more. Garrett has one more start this month and then five or six next month. But do you think he's building a pretty good case for Cy Young? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, he's having that kind of season. Um, you know, still a ways to go, um, but he's he's in the middle of a of a really special season. And with uh, DJ, we've talked about how a lot hasn't changed results-wise with since the hitting coach change, but it has changed with DJ. Do you think Casey has had... You said something was unlocked. Is that something that they work together? You noticed that he had something to do with him improving? Yeah, again, I think I think Sean's had done a really good job connecting with these guys. And, and that said, you know, Brad and, and Casey Dykes, have, I think they've worked really well together, you know. And, and in some cases, we've seen, we've seen results come. Um, others, it's still been a struggle. Um, but... You know, this this is a really good night against against a good pitching staff and a and a really good pitcher. Do you feel like today was Garrett's best start of the season? <clears throat> yeah, that's what I was trying to say at the start. Um, I mean, to me, it felt as good as as good as any I've seen. Um, you know, I don't I don't know specifically if maybe uh, running back through if oh maybe that one was, um, but tonight to me he looked really really good. Yeah, we came against Minnesota earlier. Do you feel like this was better? Um, I don't know. I, I said to him afterwards, I said, that, that's about as good as I've seen you right there. Um, that's what it looked like to me against, you know, obviously a really good offense that's familiar with him.